Ricky V here with another quick news snippet video. I was perusing around the internet last week and saw that something that I have been interested in for years has turned five years old. That's the Apple Watch. Yes, congratulations to the Apple Watch. You are now five years old. That's like a toddler's age, I guess, <laughs> compared to the Mac and other computers that Apple has in their lineup. Hey, that's a pretty new device, but it's very, very popular. And here are my thoughts on this. I think this is one of Apple's most beautiful devices. It's curvy, it's just rounded and edged and beautiful. I mean, the only thing more beautiful than this Apple Watch is my voluptuous girlfriend. <laughs> I have one reason why I have never gone out and bought an Apple Watch, even though I've always wanted one since the day they came out, and that is right here. That's my one reason. Mechanical watches. I've always been intrigued by the nature of the gears and the workmanship of a good mechanical watch. I prefer the feeling of them. I prefer having a device on my wrist that's mechanical and has all these cool little moving parts inside of it that sure they may have needed a little bit of tweaking here and there, but for the most part, especially the higher end ones, were very accurate at keeping time. So do I feel there's a need for me to go out there and have the Apple Watch? Not necessarily, because I can get the exact same feeling or need taken care of with a mechanical watch, and I feel it's a lot more elegant of a design. But what do you think? Would you rather have an electronic device to help you keep time? Or would you rather have a mechanical device that you keep on your wrist or somewhere on your person to help you keep time? Put a comment down below. Let's have a small conversation about it. And of course, my YouTube fans, as always, I trust you all learned something and enjoyed watching this video.